everyone, I'm Margaret and welcome to Deliciously Sweet and Savory. Today, I'm going to show you how to convert leftover chicken or turkey into a salad using fruits and vegetables that can be served as a sandwich or with crackers. In this video, I'll be showing you how to make the chicken salad and use it for a sandwich. So let's get started. For the chicken salad recipe, you need cooked chicken, Greek yogurt with dill, Napa cabbage, apple, salt, and black pepper. To make the sandwich, you need some type of bread, or you can use a lettuce or cabbage leaf. I'm using French bread and a Napa cabbage leaf to make the sandwiches with. But you can use any type of bread, wrap, or leaf that you'd like. You also need condiments for the sandwich. I'm using spinach leaves, onions, and shredded Napa cabbage, but tomatoes, lettuce, cucumbers, radishes, red or green peppers, etc. could also work. So get creative and use ingredients and produce you enjoy. First, let's set up the ingredients. Take two leaves from the Napa cabbage. If you don't have Napa cabbage, just chop up some regular cabbage and shred some lettuce instead. To cut the Napa cabbage, separate the white part from the leafy part. Then take the leafy part and cut it into pieces one inch thick, or finely shred it into slices one or two millimeters thick. Next, take the white part, trim off the end, and cut into slices one eighth of an inch thick. Then take the slices and finely chop into cubes, an eighth of an inch in size. Once finished, set aside so we can chop the apple and chicken. Now peel and core the apple. Then cut into slices one eighth of an inch thick and finely chop into cubes one eighth of an inch in size. Next, cut the cooked chicken into slices, then chop. Make sure to finely chop the chicken. If you want, you can use a food processor for this step. Now that our ingredients are set up, we can begin making the chicken salad mix. Add the chicken to a large bowl. Then add five tablespoons of Greek yogurt with dill. You can also use mayonnaise instead if you want. Then mix thoroughly. You want the mixture to have a smooth and creamy consistency. So add more Greek yogurt or mayonnaise if needed. Now add the chopped white part of the Napa cabbage and the chopped apple. Then mix to evenly distribute the ingredients. Next add salt and freshly ground pepper to suit your taste. Then mix thoroughly. Once finished, we can now begin assembling our sandwiches. I'm using a four inch by four inch piece of bread. Take your bread and slice it in half lengthwise if needed. Then add about four tablespoons of chicken salad mix and any condiments you'd like. Put as little or as much of the chicken salad mix and condiments as you wish. Then the sandwich is ready to serve. You can also make a sandwich using a cabbage or lettuce leaf, which is a great low calorie and gluten free alternative. It is also a great option if you are looking to have a light meal. Either way, the addition of the apples and Napa cabbage to the chicken salad add a bit of sweetness and crunch to the sandwich that complements the flavor of the chicken and dill Greek yogurt well. You can eat this as a sandwich with crackers or with a vegetable salad. This chicken salad also pairs well with a variety of produce and condiments. So get as creative as you'd like and have fun giving this recipe a try. If you enjoyed this recipe, please leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more recipes like this one. The link to the written instructions for my recipes is provided in the description. Also, if there are any recipes, Cuban or otherwise, that you'd like to see, leave a comment below. Thanks for watching and see you soon with another recipe.